humbleness in my understanding is has to do with ego so how you compare yourself to others so me as a person how do i feel about myself on this earth how do i see myself how big or how small do i see myself on this earth do i feel like my existence is more important than let's say other human beings or other life forms here on earth do i feel more or less i feel like that's what i feel like your answer is going to dictate your your humbleness level let's call it right so it, it it's it's a it's very complicated it's a complicated topic because in order to achieve great stuff in your life stuff that is record breaking that is going to change the world you have to tap into your ego a lot mike tyson is a perfect example of this he taps into this and he he talks about this a lot he 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 mentions that ego is necessary in order for you to achieve greatness you have to believe in yourself you have to feel and think and act like you are destined for more that you are more and sometimes when you tap into your ego and stray away from your humbleness a lot of people are going to confuse that with arrogance or cockiness but i think it just comes down to how you respond when you when you get to that certain level of greatness or to that certain level of 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 achievement how do you act after you accomplish whatever it is you were trying to accomplish to put myself into example i'm a professional boxer my goal is to become champion of the world i need to tap into my ego i need to i need to feel myself a little bit i got to feel myself a little bit i have to think mike tyson again i prefer to mike tyson because i really believe mike tyson's philosophy of life some people say his his philosophy today is amazing but i feel like mike tyson has always had this this higher intellectual to him he's just it's just the way he's been promoted in his early boxing years that made him seem a bit more aggressive or assertive not to say that he wasn't but they portrayed him to be just that and it kind of crazy and dumb but no he's really he's his he's uh I think Mike Tyson uh, has life has shaped him into the person he is now. I think Mike Tyson is a great human being. He's always been a great human being. It's just now he 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 really has the time to uh, to really show it to the world. He's not focused on beating people up anymore. He's focused on becoming a better human being.